is, don't you? Of course I do. Three three six. That's the game, baby. For the sun, got it going high. I ain't tripping for the fun. Yeah, I won't start. I ain't tripping on a stunt. Oh. Performance East, best place on earth. Sort of a place where you can have a side by side or a four wheeler, <laughs> maybe even both. Not only do the upper class come here and buy straight out, but so does the low end and the middle class finance for a few years. That right there, that's Austin. He's a sales manager. That's the man you want to come see when you come here to buy your brand new unit. And that, well that's Fleetwood. We don't really know his job title, but he's always very friendly and very kind when we come in the door, always greeting us, saying hello, and always having small talk with us. And then you got Jacob. He's your service manager. So when you break something or you need a full service done, you come see Jacob over here and he'll take care of you. And then we got TJ. That's the guy I'm always bothering to death about some new parts and all that stuff, because he is your parts manager. Here's Cameron, great with customer service. Look, he even holds the door for people and welcomes him in to Performance East. Then we got the man himself, Jay Money. My partner for a long time. Been with me since Busco's ever started. He's been on this crazy YouTube adventure with me for quite a while now. He's my right hand man. And then there's me, Joe. No cool name like KK1K or Jay Money. Just plain Jane Joe. I'm the one of your main faces of the channel. You see me all the time. I'm the one that does most of the talking. You guys probably get tired of hearing my voice, but this is my lifestyle. This is my performance ease. You guys come and see them, make sure you tell them that we sent you. So guys, come down and check out Performance East. They got two locations. The one I'm currently at now, the one we show up to every single time is Goldsboro, North Carolina. They not only carry ATVs, side-by-sides, jet skis, and boats, but they also carry all your off-road and outdoor apparel, coolers, boots, shoes, and their very own Performance East shirts. They even hook you up with some fresh sunglasses. You always got to have a nice set of those. New parts, boat accessories, you name it, it's all here. Oh, that is right, guys. 336 Mud Mafia, we are back. Me and Jay Money. We have just pulled in to Performance East. Now, we have gotten wind from Austin and Toby and the owners here at Performance East that they want us to build us a new unit, to, to build a unit new to us and maybe for a sender for us. Who knows? Now, with that being said, let's go in and just talk with some people and see what they got for us because you never know with Performance East. They might have something up their sleeve. And I'm pretty sure this one's going to be really big. So, let's go in here and talk to Austin, see what we can get planned out, see what they got for us. And we'll pick you guys up in just a minute. Oh, you know what my favorite part is coming here every time? This new smell when you walk in the door. Every time. Everything is just brand new in here. All the boats, jet skis, the clothing apparel, everything's just brand new and it's the best smell in the world. Air conditioned too. It is. You get anything done today? No, not at all. Oh, Jay Money. There's that outline that they started the doing giveaway? the tickets for, the giveaways. Yes, I think that's for the uh, the Robert Parker benefit. Yes, I do remember this. We bought several of those tickets. They're $10, guys, a piece here. If you come to Performance East and get you a couple tickets, you can win this Outlander 850. That's pretty slick. I like that color, don't you? Don't see it much. Jay Money, finally they listened to me. They put Oakley Sutros in there. Look right there, guys. If you guys want to wear glasses like what we got, Oakley Sutros, Performance East has them on hand now. They used to only carry pit vipers, which are behind me. Now they finally got Oakley Sutros in the cases ready to go. These are some new glasses, Jay. They call them a Smith or something. They call them like the type of what's going to replace the uh, like coasters. Riding, riding goggles and stuff, I think. Do you like those? I kind of like those blue ones, how they look, kind of dog. Looks like Sutros. Mm -hmm. I could actually wear this. I actually mess with those. I like those a lot. Might have to get a price on some new glasses too while we're here. Yeah. Today is our favorite salesman's birthday. It's mm -hmm. Austin's birthday. We're going to awesome, surprise buddy. him. I don't know what is today. 20th? 21st, I 21st. think. 21st. All right, we ready? We're going to scream happy birthday as we walk through the store? Yeah. Thanks, All right, you go first. All right, here we go. They say you don't like being in front of cameras on really. Risky as much, right, so we're going to really get him with day. this. Yeah. There he is. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear my buddy. Happy birthday to Make a wish, bud. Make a wish. I won't already blew out for you. Yeah. See, you gotta do it. There it is. <laughs> Hey, good buddy. Happy birthday, man. Of course. 
Austin, buddy, you got something for me today. I know you do. You and Toby both told me you got something. Yeah, man. I'm gonna pull around for you. All right, where, which side are we going to? Oh, let's go to the front of the building. All right. J Money. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. Is the channel ready for this? I mean, people have been asking for it. I mean, for a long time, just not our thing, but here we are. Oh my gosh, I'm actually digging that too. I am freaking digging that. Y'all check this out. Oh my gosh, a freaking Outlander 1000 XT. And look at that blue, guys. That is freaking slick. They have been asking about Outlander for a while. Long time. Very long time. What do you guys think? Drop down in the comments right now on this freaking 2023 Outlander 1000 XT. And it's the short wheelbase, of course, not that long wheelbase. And it's blue too, bro. So we've never had a blue unit. Can you imagine the color combo we can go with this thing? All right. Oh my God. I, I see a lot of potential sitting here, Jamie. I really do. I see a lot of potential. And I just kind of get down with that look too, not being a freaking XMR. I love my XMRs, don't get me wrong. Love our Renegade, but that look, look at that right there guys that is so mean looking 2023 outlander 1000 xt this will be a definitely a first would it not oh yeah let's go ahead and get this outlander through on the trailer here and let's get it back to our shop and go over what's about to happen i am digging the new look j money hey is that you or what? No, I ain't me. You're not gonna replace Bumblebee with it? Ain't no renegade. Hey, I know it's not a renegade, but it still looks freaking slick. Oh my gosh. We're gonna get this thing strapped down and taken back to our shop, and then we're gonna go over what's about to happen. You guys stick around. We'll pick you guys up as soon as we get to the shop. <laughs> oh, Jay Money. What do you think? What do you think about that, my man? A freaking new unit, bro? That's wild. Ain't never had one like this. No, and you guys are always asking when we're gonna do Outlander, when we're gonna build one of these. Well, the time has come and we are building a 2023 Outlander XT1000R. I'm gonna tell you, she is slick. I'm not a big blue guy, but that blue is freaking fire, bro. I don't see it much. No, have you ever seen the red one that looks just like this, but red everywhere? Yep. Now that is a freaking color, bro. But this blue, not gonna lie, it's growing on me and this thing is pretty, I mean, it sets it off, seriously. I think it's like a, like a, a beautiful type blue. I got dark, deep blue. What do you like and not like about this Outlander? I know it's Outlander, we're renegade people, but honestly. Overall? Yeah. I mean, honestly, the way XT is, it's the tires. Don't really do much for them. I don't really like this down. Yeah, I'm not fans of whatever this is. However they've done a handguard, that's pretty, that's pretty lame. I don't like that at all. That's kind of Arctic cat looking or something. I don't know, it looks like, it's like fake or something like cheap plastic. I have no idea. I'm not crazy how they did the, like, the displays. I mean, that's, that's okay, but it's, it's, it's got to grow on us. Bones are there. Yes, it is. It very, and it's a short wheelbase, 1,000. And bro, just ride it through the parking lot and load it up. This freaking thing absolutely rips. So now you guys are wondering three things. First, what are we going to do to it? Second, why did we get Outlander? And third, this is going to be a really popular one. Why did you copy Braden with the XT? All right, time out. We did not copy Braden. Here's the deal with this blue Outlander. We are also sponsored by Performance East, just like Braden, just like Kyle. We have talked to a little bit of agreement with some Toby and Austin, some of the guys there at Performance East. We are actually gonna start building units once a month. We're gonna see how this one goes for Performance East to for them to sell as a Mud Mafia edition sponsored four-wheeler or side-by-side, -side, whatever we're building. And this just, just so happened to land on that first four-wheeler. Now, with that being said, Jay Money, you know how we do, we do really big things with side-by-side? Uh, -side? full body paints and powder coats and you know big wheels portals tires you name it and you know how we do our renegades full body powder coats everything done up all the way everything touched yeah yeah now with this being our first one i'm not 100 percent sure we're going to go all the way out with taking the a-arms off the springs all that good stuff swing arms you name it we're probably not going to go all the way out with it but we've got some good ideas in mind such as floorboards rear racks exhaust flashing and tuning wheels tires shifters gas caps maybe a snorkel maybe a relocate clutch kit who knows we're going to just try this one out first build this one first as the mafia would build me and jay money speaking jay money's got good taste i have good taste you've seen some of the stuff we've built renegade wise and side by side stuff i think we're gonna be able to put a good touch beautiful touch on this blue outlander 1000 xt here's some other cool things that you're gonna want to know about this build for this outlander not only is the mafia building it me and jay money here but we're also when we get done gonna put our own twist and touch on it like maybe some mafia graphics 336 mud mafia logos key tags to go with it maybe even a shirt or a hat to go with this for when you come out performance season and purchase it after we build it this will be starting out the mafia sponsored mafia touch outlander sold at performance east so when we get done with this thing, all the parts come in, we totally give this thing a makeover and redo everything. It will be back at Performance East up for sale for you guys to come and get, showing, hey, I got a Mafia built four-wheeler. What do you think, J-Money? Does that sound like a pretty good plan or what? I think it's gonna be 
great. Seriously, some of these guys are saying, we've had a lot of people ask us, email us, and message us, will you build us a four-wheeler? Well, we're gonna start out with this Outlander XT1000 to start off with. After that, who knows what we might do? We might do some side-by-sides, could do some renegades, like our expertise, or open for anything, but we want another reason for you guys to see one of these and get one of these from Performance Heats is something we have worked on. You guys might be big fans and really want a new four-wheeler or want a four-wheeler, and you might just run across getting the Mafia-built four-wheeler at Performance Heats. Now, with this and J Money, I feel like we're gonna need a little bit of help, don't you? Oh, we're gonna need some help from everybody. Guys, go down in the comments right now, right now as we speak, and leave me a part or leave me some kind of aftermarket part to put on this Outlander. Okay, guys, I want your opinion. Leave it down in the comments like, hey, Joe, put these tires on it. Hey, Joe, put these wheels on it. Hey, Joe, put these whatever on it. Exhaust, you name it, put it down in the comments, and we might just pick your comment and put your part on that fuller for it to be sold and for it be shown all over the world. Now, you guys know, of course, we're probably going to be using Lucky 7, Super ATV, all of our good sponsors like that right there. Well, that being said, we got a lot of work to do, a lot of parts to start ordering, and uh, we got to get busy on this Outlander because we want you guys to see us ASAP. We might even go take it for a test ride, Jay Money. What do you think? I think we should test it for sure. It's, right. it's only got what, 1.8, 1.9 miles on it? Brand spanking new. 2023 right off the showroom floor, right out of the box. Let us know what you guys want to see below. What do you want to see this Outlander turn into? What kind of parts? How big are we going? How loud are we going? How nasty are we going to make it? Guys, if you enjoyed this video, I know it's a little bit different, a little bit shorter of a video. If you enjoyed it, please smash that thumbs up and uh, share us around. That's what we've been, please, begging you guys. That's what we've been asking you guys for a while. Share us around. Let's keep it growing. Let's get Mafia back up on top. Let's boom this thing, guys. I know you guys can do it. I believe in you. Me and Jay Money believe in you. You know who the gang is. 336, baby. Now, if you need any merchandise, look at this stuff. It's fire. That gray shirt there. We don't have any of this on there yet, but we could bring it back for you guys if you really wanted to see some more Aquagate merch. Check out 336mudmafia.com. Follow us on Instagram, 336.mud.mafia. And always, like I said, subscribe, thumbs up, leave that comment, and we'll catch y'all on the next one.